Hello guys, uh, welcome to, uh, part one of my Half-Life 2 Let's Play. I have to turn the volume up real quick. I'm gonna turn it down, actually. Now, um, alright, so, uh, today we're gonna be playing Half-Life 2. Uh, Let's Play 1. I might put a headset on next part if this gets, like, annoying. Hold on, I actually mo need to move the computer, so uh, sorry if you hear, like, clicking noises. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so, um, it's Half-Life 2. Um, yeah. We're gonna be playing uh, Half-Life 2 today. Um, after this, I will most likely then play Half-Life 2 Episode 1, Half-Life 2 Episode 2, and then, uh, maybe, just maybe, Half-Life 2 Lost Coast, and, uh, maybe Half-Life 1, and both with expansion packs after that. But let's do Half-Life 2 first. Alright, are you guys ready? Uh, by the way, uh, thanks to, um, for some odd reason, Source games actually run a lot better than most of the stuff on my computer. Um, I'm able to have, uh, I appreciate them. I'm able to have the graphics quality to literally the highest it can go. And, uh, that's unusual from an, uh, older, a slightly older computer like mine. Anyway, enough about, um, my computer. Let's play Half-Life 2. By the way, I'm gonna try not to talk during like the important cutscenes, so you can hear it. All right. All right, I'm gonna mute my mic here till the intro's done. All right. On. All right. Rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So, wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. case anymore. It's just like Minecraft, because like usually when Welcome I'm not recording, like I could run at like the highest you have chosen or been chosen to relocate as soon as to I one start of our recording. finest remaining urban centers. However, this episode I is mainly so much of City on. 17 that I elected to establish my administration here in the citadel so thoughtfully provided by our benefit. So I most likely will I've been also. proud to call well, City 17 my home. <laughs> and so, whether you are left. here to stay or passing through All right, your way to parts unknown, welcome to hey, City 17. Me? It's safer. Okay, okay, okay. Well, are you the only ones on that train? Oh, I don't know something I can do here. I Dang it! Oh, he's not done with punishment? Yeah, I'll just want to throw another one at him. Here, take this. That's enough of that. Welcome. Welcome to this way. So, yeah, I might lower the graphics quality next video. Because, well, this is... Dr. Brain again? 
I was hoping I'd I see mean, more uh, of him in City I'll 14. I'll see the comment. What should I do for the next one? Out. Should it's I, um, my lower the graphics quality here. itself? In the Citadel, so thoughtfully provided the, um, by our benefactors. I've been and proud to call like City 17 my home. I'm not gonna lower it down to, like, 6. And so, whether you are here to stay or... I don't know. To City 17. It's safer here. This must be a mistake. I got a standard relocation coupon just like everybody else. Okay then. Barney it's me, Gordon. Barney from Black Mesa. Yeah, and sorry for the scare. I had to put on a show for the cameras. I've been working undercover with civil protection. I can't take well, too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, Barney, what is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, Doc, but look who's here. Great Scott! Gordon Freeman! I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get him here. Well, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. Listen, I gotta go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Very well. And, uh, Gordon, good to see you. Okay, Gordon. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. Oh, man, that's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Pile up some stuff to get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. I'll meet up with you later. Sorry about that. Just a little plot point happened, and I didn't want to annoy anyone. Anyway, as I was saying, well, it appears that the, um, the frame rate is picked up a bit. So, all I'm gonna say, though, okay, well, all I'm gonna say is that if this doesn't become painful to watch, then, um, I might keep it at the graphic settings in it. But, um, if it gets annoying, like, frame rate-wise or something like that, I might lower the DX level and the graphics quality in general. Okay, so real quick before I continue, you're probably wondering what a DX level is. Okay, so it's basically upstating the version of DirectX that Half-Life 2 will be using. I could use the oldest version, 6.0, which is not supported and could crash and I'm not going to use it. Um, or you could use the newest, which is uh, DX9, or DirectX 9.0. And, um, yeah, that's where I'm running at right now. So, um, if this becomes annoying, I'm gonna lower it to DirectX 8.0, which is a slightly older version, but still does pretty good. And that's what I'm saying, because I could keep up a decent frame rate then. Okay, en enough about that, let's continue the game. I just wanted to explain that. Alright, so we hit our first loading trigger. Let's, um, yeah. Alright. And also, this weird phenomenon in the walls, this is kind of annoying, actually. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna lower the DX level. Hold on, actually, real quick, I need to check some settings. On, I just need to know the brightness. I see the brightness. Yeah, I see the DirectX version, uh, I might lower that to 8. Alright, um, is there really, like, a brightness in Gamma here, or do I have to use the uh, thing on my computer? Awesome. Yeah, I'm playing on easy, because I'm a sissy Mary. If you want me to iron it a bit, then... Uh, yeah. No. 
<laughs> no, you're not coming after me. Okay, what the heck is this? Okay, 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 okay. Get out of the way, get out of the way. I'm running here. You're not gonna get me. You're not gonna get me. I'm gonna hide behind this little thing here. I might not be able to find you. Oh crap. I'll just let him hit me. Did you start to abuse me like that? Okay, okay, you hit me again. Rather than I didn't expect him to whack me. First, oh, let okay, us consider the fact that really for the first time ever, as a species, all right, guys, I'm gonna play through like this entire area, and I promise you, in the next part, this I'm gonna simple move fact the has far-reaching implications. Come on, I'm just gonna put like a little fix on it for now. I'm sorry about this. I'm gonna change the the texture detail to medium. Hopefully that should be enough to just kind of fix it for the rest of the video and then the next video. Yeah, so I hope. It also requires planning and forethought and yeah, direct opposition really to our neural precepts. I'm sorry about that. I find it, it helpful at times episode. like these to remind myself that I'm not recording, like, I could run all this in 60 FPS. Um, hello? Our true uh, enemy is instinct. Uh, okay. Instinct was our mother when we were an infant species. Instinct uh, I'm just gonna us try not to do much observation. Alright, so we're in City 17, yada yada yada. Um, well, we're enslaved by this elite race called the Combine, which is the defense of stuff in this game, yada yada yada. Yada, yada, yada. Uh, Dr. But Breen inseparable from Dick instinct Dick is its dark twin, superstition. Instinct is inextricably bound to unreasonable But actually, there are some theories about, like, Dr. Rains and stuff in the game, but I might go over some of those at the end of the game instead, because, uh, there'll be massive spoilers. Like, uh, someone hasn't played Half-Life 2 before. Um... Also here is little incoherent uh bull crap down there. Seriously, it's almost as bad as Donald Trump. But um there's a theory about why he's actually doing that, but uh, like I said, I'm not gonna go over it because there's gonna be spoilers. So yeah, you have to wait until the end of the let's play. In fact, even then uh I'll I only go over like a bonus video about like the theories. This is how it always starts. First the building, then the whole block. They have no reason to come to our place. Don't worry, they'll find one. <laughs> oh yeah, this part's creepy. Can you hear children? Okay, so here's a spoiler list. Lore, um, about why there's no children in here. So, the Combine put up this thing called the Suppression Field, which basically prevents human reproduction. So what the Combine are planning on doing here is they want to take the human race in slavery, and then they want to, uh, basically just kind of run them to extinction with the Suppression Field, and then pretty much the planet is theirs. Uh, do you have to threaten me? Alright, um... Yeah, it's a pretty cool game. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna lower the DX level and then the graphics quality, and maybe some of the other factors of the graphics quality. I hope the lowering in graphics quality doesn't become painful to watch, though. Because, uh, I really- I literally couldn't find anything else to play for the channel, so I thought, yeah, why not have it too? Now, so I I'm not really commenting on the game that much, it's really... Oh, here, you want some funny? Oh, hey, hey, it's Dr. Cop. Green. Dr. Who's Green. One of us? I have something for you. I told you they'd be coming for us next. This is one of your wrong. Oh, and there's that thing for the playground. It's sitting on the tables. Uh, crap. Hold on, let me try that again. Oh, wait, dang it. There we go. Alright, now let's, um... 
Was that you knocking? I didn't even know we still had a door. That's enough of that. That's enough of that. Alright, hold on, I'm gonna throw this chair out a window into this table. Then I'm gonna continue. Alright, say bye bye to the furniture. Alright, now that we're done breaking their property, let's continue. Alright, so now that go around here, the combine should start chasing. Attention, residents. Yep, here we go. Miscount detected in your block. Cooperation with your civil protection team. Permit um, for rations in the wall. Maybe as I start going up, I'll see him He's supposed to start running up these stairs. Psst. Hey, oh, you! No, In here! Oh, no, that, that, that's the wrong place. for the roof! Place. There's no time to lose! Do they come? <gasps> okay, keep going. Okay, this is... Okay. Get in here, quick! Keep moving, head for the roof! Yeah, I can actually see them, like, go in there and kill them. Dr. Freeman, I presume. We better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. Dr. Kleiner said you'd be coming this way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. I'm Alex Vance. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure you don't remember me, though. Man, a few words, aren't you? Remember him from Black Mesa? Alright, um, I'm sorry guys, but I'm actually gonna have to cut the part here. Uh, you're all um, in the next episode we'll, uh, find out. Um, we'll meet Dr. Kleiner, and we can actually get to stopping the Combine. Alright, so see you next time. Goodbye.